good afternoon. Um, this is supposed to be a, a sort of a, a semi-documentary, um, you know, on uh, mysteries or haunted events that may have taken place here at uh, High Brighton High School. And I've got one that uh, has come to mind, which I thought would be kind of interesting. There's many times that you folks don't even realize that I come out here at nighttime when there's an alarm that goes off, and of course, I have to go through the building with the police department. And uh, if you don't think this building doesn't talk at nighttime, it uh, does a lot of uh, creaking and uh, you know making strange sounds. And of course, one of the biggest events that we had, we had in D building, came in through the back lobby of the gym, and that's where the alarm showed that there was movement. Police officer and I got there at about three in the morning, and when I opened the door, we both got in about, oh, two, three steps inside the door, and this black cat came screaming right between my legs, about gave the police officer a heart attack, and of course, needless to say, uh, it made my heart beat a couple times faster. So that's one of the, you know, little weird things that happens around here at High Brighton. Hi, I'm uh, Landon Klein, Dylan Rink. Um, we are with FPS, the Foothills Paranormal Society. Um, this is High Brighton High School that we're at right now. We got some, some stories from some of the faculty here about some experiences they've been having. Um, so we are here to check it out. It is um, 10 o'clock on May 8th, and we're going to do an investigation of the school. For the first part of the tour, I think we're going to start. Should we start? Start A off? Yes. And yeah. I think we're going to start in the main hallway here. Wow. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Is everyone ready? We're going dark. <laughs> All right. Um, for the first part of the tour, we're gonna to go up this hallway and see if we can find any experiences here. What I have here is a EMF reader. What it does is it picks up electro something frequency. And if there are any spirits or any energy here, um, the spirits will draw that to this thing and it'll light up. Um, if it usually, if it just makes a couple of beeps, there's nothing here, it's just normal readings. Are there any spirits here? There are any spirits here. Can you make yourself known? Spike the bar on our reader. That's creepy, dude. If there are any spirits here who want to make themselves known, or want to talk to us, please do. What did Mr. Ingram say that he saw? It was just a uh, black cat, right? A black cat, and he heard noises in the D hall. Yeah. Okay. It could just be a black cat, but. Yeah. And then the cat getting to school, make a lot of noise. We still haven't had any experiences at all. I'm not getting anything on the EMF reader. Watch your step. Okay, now we are on B level. And it's extremely dark. I just saw a reflection. Well, well there's the camera. Yeah, there's the windows. I don't think these stories are true. I don't see anything. I don't know. I haven't heard anything. I, don't think that much death usually happens in a school anyway. That's true. If there are any ghosts here, you're a bunch of wusses. So make yourself known, or we're going to call it a night, and you will forever be known as scary cats. Are there any ghosts here? What was that noise? Is that coming from up here? Yeah. This might be our first thing. I'm still not picking up anything on the internet.
That's weird. We're the only ones in the school, right? None of our other head crew members have been up here. Well, have they? Someone turned this light on. They could have called me in the middle of the Taylor, we're the only ones in the school, right? Yeah. You haven't heard of anything you might be here? No. Mr. Robinson was out over until tonight, until midnight. Dude, that's really spooky. Yeah, that definitely wasn't on before. We're the only, the four of us right here, you two and us, we're the only ones here. Where's the last one's release? Is it working? No, it's not working. Okay, um, it seems the last switch for this light is broke now and it won't come off. Um, well, it seems we got something going on there. I don't know if it, I don't know if I would call it paranormal. It just looks like we got some faulty electricity thing situations going yeah. on here. So if there are any spirits in the school, I think you are a bunch of horses. I dare you to show yourself. If you had the gall to step out and show yourself, that would be amazing. Whoa. There's a trash can in the hallway. Was that there? Um, was it? Okay, guys, if that's all you got is moving the trash can in the middle of the hallway, that's not going to be enough. We want the body apparition. Let's make our way down to the A hall. Yeah. Um, there's been some weird things been going on. I don't think it's anything paranormal, but I think it's just an old school making a bunch of noises. So, I think they're a bunch of scary. Whoa, what's that? What's that? Uh, what was that? Where did that come from? Oh my gosh, you see that? Taylor, are you getting that on tape? What yeah, is that? I got it.